Hey guys, it is Marianne from Thrive with your tip of the day. And today I want to introduce you to the tab stop in the ruler in Microsoft Word. It's going to stop you from having to hit the space bar to line up and make indented text. So you can see in the example here, I'm going to zoom it in a little bit so it's a bit clearer. Oops, that might be a little too far. Let's try this one. So you can see I've got my headings there lined up at the very edge here. And then I've decided I want this section heading to sit in a bit. So if I take my formatting marks off, you can see I want it to be indented here to around the one on the ruler. If you don't have the ruler up, you head to view and you head to the show section and you make sure that the ruler is ticked. So it might look like that for you. That will add the ruler. But you can see here that this is lined up and I want it to be aligned with about my one. If I go back to my home tab and put my formatting marks on, you can see that I've hit the space bar a lot. That's really annoying. Let's not do that. So what we do is we go to wherever we're going to make our edit and we simply click at the one and it's put this little L in and that is a left tab and I can move it along. I can pull it out and make it go away but I can click here and it will put a left tab in. What that means now is if I was to hit the tab key on my keyboard, it goes straight to that point. And I can type in hit section heading. If I go down again, I can hit tab and start again. I can type wherever I am. I can put my spaces in. I could do anything I like with the text from here. You can have multiple tabs. So I could go one, three and six. So we can go tab, this is one, tab again, this is three, tab again, this is at the six mark. Create customized headings or customized stops for you to create indented text, uh, to draw attention to things, to make a, a specific point. So things like quotes or headings or subheadings or um, any sort of features, captions, anything that you might need to do. Work with your tab headings and stop pressing the space bar. Give it a go. See how it helps you.